Let's try next, Brooklyn! And so off the tip, it's Brooklyn. All right, Brent, early on in the year, what are you looking to see from the teams that you consider to be contenders? Well, look at teams who are playing lesser opponents to just try and put games away as early as possible. A win in November and December means just as much as the ones that happen after the All-Star break. So the importance on that first 20-game run for a veteran team can make all the difference. Rubio passes to Allen. Outside Cobb. Shot clock at five. That shot is off. Oh, excellent D there from Harden. Pass to Irving. Over Rubio. Hangs in the air. And the layup by Aldridge. How about the stretch arms there of Aldridge? Awesome at using those to gobble up a second chance opportunity. Irving against Rubio. Pass to Allen. Down low. Goes back up. And that's two points on the layup. Tremendous effort from Allen. One of the top offensive rebounders in the game. Rubio against Irving. There's a screen by Aldridge, and it's Irving off the drive. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Allen. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. Clock at six. There's a screen by Aldridge. Durant way outside. It's not going to go for him, and it's Cleveland the other way. Now Cobb, he played a great game against Boston. Pass to Allen. Outside Cobb. Tries a 10-footer. Cleveland gets it back. Allen with a screen on Durant. Cobb drives in, and Cobb slams it home. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Really not enough help there. Lack of communication on the backside. Here's Irving. Again, Irving missing. The Cavaliers have gone two for five to start today's game with the step back. And here's Rubio. Back to Cobb. Brooklyn with the board, fresh off a win against the Warriors. Hey, whatever they talked about at halftime worked wonders. Flipping that game on its head, just a great job rallying back. Rejected by Allen. Here's Cobb. He's given them steady production at over 27 points a game. Driving in, and Cobb slams it at home. If the defender is giving them that much space, the points are inevitable. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Outside Harden, trying to get back on track. And Harden with the slam. And you know, you can't underestimate Harden's ability to blow by defenders. It opens things up for him on the offensive side. And you look at Harden's endurance, able to give 100% night in and night out. And he plays as many minutes as you need. The three from Cobb. That one falls. Coming off Rubio's feed. Cobb's got his third bucket of the night. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Pass to Aldridge. Fires the three. Mobley grabs the board. You know, Grant, watching Harden, he always seems to be in attack mode. And he's consistent about it too, B.A. A lot of guys are aggressive in spurts. Harden is looking to make a play every moment he's on the floor. Outside Cobb. 
Now here's Allen. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. <laughs> They're really working the paint now. Irving, the pass to Aldridge. To the middle. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. His first foul. First team foul. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. Harden simply just has a knack for creating contact. He's perfect from the line this time. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. Right side, Cobb. Back to Allen. And it's Allen who slams it home. That is all timing right there. Just led him perfectly. Irving against Rubio. Outside Durant. Tries yet again, and rejected. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Out of bounds, it'll be Brooklyn's ball. The ball. Come on, all you got going for you is luck and the refs. Without that, you guys got nothing. Brooklyn trailing. Irving with it. He had 31 in the win against Golden State. Felt like he had a sense in that game that the defense was being over-aggressive, and he tried to take advantage of that. He continually frustrated them throughout the night and got to the free throw line. They set the pick to the paint. Here's Cobb, and the finish by Cobb! Such a huge advantage for Ricky Rubio to read plays before they happen. Rubio against Irving. The three ball! Mobley grabs the board. Mobley's got four rebounds now. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. The shot by Rubio, no good. I don't think the defense does enough out there to bother him. I think that one's all on him. Just a flat-out miss. Pass to Durant. Fires for three. It's good. Off the assist from Harden. Why, why do KD threes look like layups? Man, it's unbelievable. Now here's Rubio. What? No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Right side, Cobb. Throws it up high. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Brooklyn has gone only one of four from three-point land. Timeout called. Brooklyn and this matchup with the Cavaliers. T-shirt, T-shirt, T-shirt. Come on, everybody. We got T-shirt. Substitution here for Brooklyn. Griffin. The Cavs trailing. Duran and Griffin the combo out front. Bruce Brown is out there with James Harden. And it's Harris in at the three. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. And Allen gets it to go. The Sexton working the ball to a teammate. That's what you want to see from him. Harden finds Brown. Back to Harden. Brown, a screen on Sexton. To the inside. Here's Griffin. Rejected by Allen. And pushing it up. Here's Cleveland. Moving it up. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way. That's his second personal. Shooting for Cleveland. Something you set the trend for in Phoenix, Grant. Why do you think that's becoming more prevalent? Great question. I mean, in today's game, we're all about the analytics. And that has shown that you shoot a higher percentage earlier in the shot clock. So it makes sense to push the tempo to see what you can get early. Well, we got a close one here in Brooklyn. Pass to Allen. Back to Cobb. Drives to the hoop. And he's going to the line for two. Blake Griffin. His first foul. Team second. Blake Griffin picks one up. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. And Cobb drops them both. And about a minute gone in the second quarter. 
Outside, Brown takes one from 10 feet. The Cavaliers pull it in. Mobley's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Cobb. And the layup is good off the glass. Cobb's got 13. And force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Steps back. Here's Harden. Lays it up and banks it in. And the Nets lead by one. Inside Harden is such a tough cover. You know he's clever enough to turn any good defense into a foul. Allen with it. Harden picks him up. Here's Cobb. Banked it in off the glass. 15 points in the game. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Screen by Durant. The drive by Harden. Sweet little floater. Harden's got his third basket on the night right there. Oh, a silky floater by Harden. Making a tough shot look almost effortless. Cobb on the wing. No luck on that one. Nice D from Durant. For Brooklyn, they've gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. Griffin passes to Harden. And here's Durant. Shoots off the step back. Gets it to go. His second make in six tries. Well, they might have made contact with Durant, but really didn't affect him at all. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. KBA, hey, the Cavaliers steadily rebuilding since LeBron's departure. Their win percentage has climbed season over season. Coach Bickerstaff said, quote, development takes time, patience, and understanding. But there's a clear vision of the process that we go through to become champions once again. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thank you. Back to Harden. Just five to shoot. Over Sexton. And it comes off the front of the rim. For Cleveland, they've gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. Pass to Cobb. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the second quarter. Loses his grip. Clanks the lob. Now Brown. Averaging around six a game. Durant finds Brown. Over Cobb. Brown can't hit. Kind of rare to see any player have this much of a struggle from the field to still have the lead. Oh, that is what I'm talking oh, about. Wow. And boy, has this been a competitive matchup thus far. <laughs> These teams have swapped leads seven times already. And we're not even in the second half. Pass to Harden. There's the drive. And Harden with the slam. And KD keeping his head up that time, becoming a playmaker. Here's Cobb. Let's it go from deep. Drops in the three. Cobb's got 22. Pretty easy right now. Clear out. Give him some space. Let him get to work. Harris outside. Harden against Sexton. The kick to Durant. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the boards. Here's Cobb, and Cobb slams it home. Look at what he's doing here, and it's hard to imagine him playing much better. Sexton against Harden. Outside Durant, Griffin outside. The kick to Durant, three-pointer. And that's his third bucket at eight attempts. Just doesn't second guess his shot selection, and for good reason. A lot of those go in. You know Blake Griffin's NBA career certainly didn't have humble beginnings. I mean, he won the slam dunk contest and rookie of the year in his debut season. He really hit the ground running. Here's Okoro. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Okoro's got five points. And can make some really difficult finishes. Oh. 
Harris on the wing. Griffin against Allen. Griffin passes to Harden. And then Harden with the jam! <laughs> Check it out. Harden putting on a show, throwing down an acrobatic dunk. And while Blake Griffin's career certainly got off to a hot start, Grant, he's also managed to remain a dominant force over the years. No question. He's a guy who can get it done. Points, rebounds, assists, anything you need. He's a great example of an enduring talent. It took a little bit of time, but now he's taking the pen off the cap and putting his mark on this game. Pass to Griffin from deep three-point range. It's rebounded by Cobb. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Inside. And the lead increases on a crazy offensive sequence. Man, the dunk alone would have been incredible, let alone the fact that it came off a pinpoint pass. They set a pick. Brown drives in. And it's good for two. Brown's got the second bucket on the night. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. And a coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. And he drives in, and Cobb slams it home. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Outside Durant. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Mobley's got seven rebounds in the game. I'll tell you what, they've been aggressive and they've been physical. Sexton up top, defended by Brown. And Cobb gets it to go on the assist by Sexton. Sexton's got his fifth assist in this one. Harden, the pass to Durant. And it's Kevin Durant with the foul. Kevin Durant. That's his first. His first foul. Team second. For Brooklyn, Mills comes in for Brown. Rubio's checked in for the Cavaliers. Pass to Cobb. Back to Rubio. Outside Cobb, shoots over Mills, just five on the clock, and the basket by Rubio. I'll tell you what, they are on fire this quarter, taking total command of this game. Durant finds Harden, looking to win the run. The shot misses, the Cavaliers go the other way with it. Coming into this, having knots to win against Boston in their last game. Hey guys, can we show some love to the defense in that game? They were relentless. They were dominant. It was just a great performance overall. Yeah, last game was pretty impressive stuff on that end of the floor, just getting up near shooters and blocking as many shots as they did. Now here's Cobb, defended by Harden. Here's Allen. That's good. And it's Cobb with the assist. Cobb's got eight assists here tonight. And now, almost all their points coming from the paint. Brooklyn. Timeout called. Brooklyn. All right, everybody. Who wants that defense? Ah! Has been struggling. No, they're not preventing them from scoring. And if you can get to a high-efficiency shot on the floor, and that's the paint, you just keep going. Millsap, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Irving comes in for James Harden. Back to Harris. Pass to Irving. Fires top of the key. Doesn't go for him. And Cleveland the other way now. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Out to the right wing. Outside Cobb. To the paint. And stolen by Aldridge. Harris left side to the inside. Aldridge up top. Down low. Here's Irving. Count the bucket. Coming off a perfectly placed pass. Irving's gotten his third basket of the night. Just so few players have that kind of arsenal. When they get to the inside and have to finish, Kyrie Irving becomes elite. Cobb, shot's good. 
He played well in the first quarter, but now he's taking it to the next level. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Marketing against Millsap. Right side Mills. Harris outside. The three. He can't get that one to fall. And it's Cleveland the other way. Cobb drives in. And Mills pulls it down. Brooklyn has gone only one, one of five from beyond the three-point line in the second quarter. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Pass to Cobb. One oh three left in the second period. The three. That one falls. Coming off Rubio's feed. Rubio's got four assists now tonight. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Now here's Irving from the arc. Love grabs the miss. Love's got six rebounds now in the game. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Right side, Rubio. Here's Cobb. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Cobb's got 36 points. I love the aggressiveness. He's been on fire the entire first half and continues to strike while the iron's hot. Irving, that's good. Well, if he wants to, Kyrie can drive at will. He's got out of this world shake and bake moves. Pass to Windler from outside the arc. And the Cavaliers, another three. They've been the more poised team tonight, and the score reflects that. Yeah, just really pouring it on right now, trying to take away the opposition's motivation to keep competing in this one. And that one's good for Irving. Kyrie Irving has a sweet looking stroke right there. Fantastic at getting his feet underneath him that time. And so it's Cleveland ending the quarter with a 46. The Cavaliers, 66. Check their lead. Cleveland has gone 7 of 11 from outside the arc. Nice percentage from distance so far. On the court for the Cavaliers. Mobley and Allen together in the middle. Ricky Rubio is out there with Cobb. And it's Okoro in at the three, the small forward. Outside Cobb. Over Aldridge. No good off the back, back of the rim. That might not be the shot they want him taking, even with the D backing off. And here's Harden. 12 points for him. Pass to Durant. The six-footer. Good. Durant's got 10 points in the game. They have no answer defensively inside. Rubio passes to Allen. Here's Mobley. That's good. And it's Cobb with the assist. Cobb's got his ninth assist of the game now. And when you've got your opponent down, you don't want to take your foot off the pedal. This is what great players try to do. They're not allowing the opposition to gain any kind of hope to try and get back in the game. Outside for Harden. Let's a floater go. And there's the rejection. It's a three-on-three -three fast break. And it's Allen who slams it home. No stopping Allen there. His link makes the play almost too easy. Here's Irving. He's got 10. Pass to Aldridge. Right side, Harden. There's a screen by Aldridge. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. To the middle. Allen. And it's Allen who slams it home. Filthy. I mean, just the arena is stunned. He's got a deep bag of tricks to dig into. And Harden with the slam. And those assist numbers have always been there for Kyrie spotting an open teammate that time. 
Now here's Cobb. He's covered closely. Hey, you, right here. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Here's Okoro. Give him eight points now. Going inside, and they pick up two. Ten points for him. More and more assertive play from Isaac Okoro. This is a good sign for their offense. Screen by Durant. Here's Irving. Shoots over Mobley. Irving, that's good. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific groove right now. Seems to be nobody standing in his way. No roadblocks for him. His first foul. First team Natural athletic ability. Griffin, he's checked in for Aldridge. So both free throws good from Allen. For Brooklyn, they've gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Irving, the pass to Durant. They set the pick. Rejected by Allen. And as it goes out of bounds... Outside Irving. Griffin, a screen on Rubio. Here's Irving. There's another block. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Back to Cobb. Down to five on the shot clock. It's tipped. Allen. And it's Allen who slams it home. That's the guy they're going to keep going to as they should. The lead's only going up if they keep feeding him. And it's always fun to see a defensive powerhouse like Evan Mobley. He savors any chance he gets to affect a shot or to totally shut down an opponent. Strong performance from him. But he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. Pass to Akuro. To the paint. The kick out to Cobb. And there's the drive. And the finish by Cobb. Even with the score as it is, he just keeps coming at you. The Nets have gone four of eight in the third. Well, when you look at Mobley's collegiate stat line, blocks definitely jump out at you. He averaged almost three a game. Well, Bia, he obviously knows how to use all of his reach. But I'm sure he'll have to make some adjustments. Jared Allen, his first foul. First team foul. At the line, KG. At the line, two times. Myself, don't worry about who people say is the best player. In for James Harden. And the Cavaliers will go for a different look here. Colin Sexton coming into the league and giving starters minutes right away, so really learning on the fly. Outside Durant. Over Cobb. And again, it's the Nets missing. Well, that mid-range J usually pretty much on the money. Maybe the timing just a little bit off on that one. Takes it inside. And Cobb slams it home. All night, they've asked him to shoulder the scoring load, and he is not disappointed. Durant inside. Guarded by Cobb. Durant with the bucket. And this is one of Kevin Durant's favorite moves. Getting the defense back on its heels, then stop and pop. Pass to Cobb. Fires from deep. And the Cavaliers, another three. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. Your next 72 and your Brooklyn. And time for a short break. Stay right there. The fourth quarter is coming up next. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. Kevin Durant is out there with James Johnson. Then there's Patrick Mills. Then there's Javon Carter. And it's Okafor in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. It's tipped. 
Rubio against Carter. To the inside. And the finish by Cobb. Now, good passing in the paint may be even more important to an offense than great passing on the perimeter. Those are areas where you got to be careful. Pass to Durant. Well, Grant, you've won the NBA Sportsmanship Award three times. His first power, first team power. the line. I think trying to play the game the right way with integrity. And Conley is a guy that truly embodies that. Wade, he's checked in for the Cavaliers. I think a lot of the people in the NBA and casual fans alike excited for Kevin Durant to be playing at the level that we saw last season. I mean, that Achilles injury scared a lot of people. It's a lot of hard work. That's a foul? Sorry, I thought this was a contact sport. Awesome. He helped them get the lead, and now he's making sure they keep it. And the Nets making a change here. Brown's checked in. We played just over a minute here in the fourth. Carter finds Brown. Pass to Okafor. The shot that time not on target. And Cleveland will come the other way. Johnson with a double team. Here's Stevens, covered by Johnson. Inside. Cobb on the wing. Up and over Carter. Here's Rubio. And a miss there on the triple. And the Nets with possession here. Following this game, they host the Magic. That'll be the end of a three-game homestand. Pass to Okafor. Now here's Brown. Defense right on him. Outside Mills. Carter with it. From 10 feet away. Cavaliers with a rebound. Cobb's got five rebounds tonight. Rubio with the ball. Fourth quarter of play. We're about two and a half minutes through it now. And got it! Another basket! And that gives him 51. Making it look easy. That's going to be over and back. Not watching the line on that one. Ooh! like to thank everyone for coming out and supporting the team. Please make sure to get home safely and we'll see you next game. Hey guys. Okay, Frank, you want to start? Now, MP, at what point is defense not enough if you want to make a mark in this league? Who are you, who are you asking me? Look, look, you, you did a great job defensively tonight, but, but I'm asking what other parts of your game need to expand in order to reach your potential. Look, I don't, I don't really know where you're getting at. I contributed all over the place. We won. I don't see a problem, and I feel like I'm doing a great job at realizing my potential, so I think you're way off base here, Frank. All right, all right, all right. Fair enough, fair enough. Thanks for your time. Okay. Andrew, you're next. You had NBA Twitter going nuts with your shooting performance tonight. Do you feel like one of the top marksmen in the league now? Man, it's just great to be recognized, but it's a team game. You know, tonight's my shots were going in, but my teammates, they was giving me the open looks. Yeah, but you were the one draining all those threes out there. Folks were comparing you to Steph Curry. <sighs> Whoa. <laughs> That's humbling, man. I, I grew up watching Steph and Ray Allen. Those are two of my heroes, for sure. Do you feel like you've got the same kind of range they have? Look, I'm working to get there. I haven't proven it over time like they have, but it's, it's coming. 